What's going on YouTube? Brandon Lechuga here and welcome to 303 Streets. YouTube, welcome back to 303 Streets. This is Brandon Lechuga. I'm gonna do a quick video today. Um, not in the Lamborghini, not in the GTR or the truck but the Daily Driver 2017 Nissan Rogue. This is a 2.5 liter, and today we're gonna do the intake filter that is located right over there. Um, and we're gonna show you how to change it really quick and everything that you need tool-wise from start to end. So, real quick, we're gonna go over to the, your driver's side door, and you're gonna release the latch right there on the right side next to the gas. That's gonna release the hood so you can pop it up. Then you're gonna use this little lever right here, push it to your left release the hood um you're gonna get the stand out from up here it pulls up and out swings around and drops in there so once you do that you're gonna grab a flathead screwdriver and you're gonna remove two of these uh little plastic connectors right that go right there and there and how you pop those up really simple uh, take your flathead put it under and twist and then you should just be able to kind of pull it out like that when you put it back in Keep make sure that it's up still and then press down and it's locked. So you're gonna remove two of those that go right there. Then you're gonna come over to here on the intake and there's gonna be a little bolt. You can either use a 10 millimeter socket or wrench or a Phillips screwdriver, um, either or works. Remove that. Then you'll come over to the actual intake. And the reason why you have to remove this piece is because you can't open the box without this being out of the way. So there's a little clip that goes right up top. You're going to unclip that. It should pull out. Then you're going to have a clip on the top right, clip on the top left, and there's your old filter. So as you can see, there's a little tab right there that indicates the top left. This is very dirty. I did clean it. Um, I blew it out before I got a new filter, so I was trying to make it last, but it's shot. So take that filter to set it right there. Here's what we're using. I got it at Walmart for like $11. Um, same filter as you can see, a little tab up there. Um, good for 12,000 miles, cheaper than AutoZone, O'Reilly's, so on and so forth. So that's the part number. Take your new filter, drop it in, clip the tab on the right. Oh, gotta make sure it's in all the way. There we go. No. All right, there's that. Do the left. Slide this back in. This is the most difficult part, especially if you only have one hand. It's a little bit more difficult to make sure that it clips. There we go. So that's clipped back in. And then you're just gonna replace the bolt that you took out. So make sure that it's lined up. Place that back in. I lost one of those um, little tabs that goes in here. And this one's kind of jacked up, so replace it. Boom, done in three minutes and nine seconds. So um, hopefully you found this video helpful. Um, really simple, really easy to do. Like I said, I did it in you know three minutes explaining stuff even. But yeah, so that's how you replace the intake filter in your car. And replacing that helps make sure you get good gas mileage and your car's running to the optimal prime to make sure that you know it's being getting proper air for the engine and it's functioning properly. Without it functioning properly, it could, you know, idle rough and stuff. So we're just going to, eventually I'm going to go over um, everything doing maintenance. Uh, I did an oil change on this car not, uh, not too long ago. Um, I wish I would have recorded it, but I didn't. So um, I'll do one on that when it's time for an oil change. Uh, but yeah, that's really simple, easy way to change out your air filter for your car. Or not your air filter, your intake filter. So um, if you found this video helpful, like, subscribe, and have a good day. Uh, this is Brandon Lechuga with 303 Streets, and stay tuned for videos on the Lamborghini and the GTR to come. Thank you, and have a good day.